Hey everyone, it's good to see you again. 2020 has been one hell of a year and that is the nicest way I can put it. Even with everything that happened, there were some things that I learned I think a lot of people kind of learned too. So as the title implies, this is pretty much going to be like the overall what I got out of 2020. Um, the one big takeaway that I learned is that you can't give up. Like there are going to be so many times where you're like, I don't want to do this anymore. I'm done. What's the point? And you just, you just can't. Like you can get to that point, but do not stop there. Okay. Like you have to keep going mainly because like you honestly do not know the impact that you have on this world. Even if it's just like you smile at someone, you say hello, you might have just changed that person's day. Like they might have been having one of the worst times of their life and you just being kind to them saved them. Um, another huge thing that I kind of learned was um, resilience. Like I do not know how many times where it's like I've posted a video or like something just happened and I got easily discouraged. And honestly, discouragement is my Achilles heel. That's something that I need to work on. But it was the fact that it's just like, no matter what came your way, like the punches just kept on coming. As we saw, you have to be resilient and you have to push through it no matter what you have to do. Even if it's just like you being resilient is laying in your bed and crying for a day. If that is what gets you up the next day, that's perfectly fine. Um, I think one of the biggest things for this world was change. Not everyone understands that change is pretty much what makes us human. We did not get to where we are by not changing. And we have to continue to change in order for us to achieve our fullest potential. Just from looking at what's happened here where I am in the United States and the world, we needed to continue to change because we are still in this moment where it's like racism is still running rampant. There's still slavery going on in the world. So many things that I kind of look at, I'm like, this is why we need to continue to change because we still have issues that have plagued us for centuries and we are still combating them. That is why change is essential. For people who disagree with change, you really think that if we just did not evolve from hunter gatherers that we would be sitting here right now in these houses driving these cars and stuff no that's part of evolution we constantly evolve that is natural that is what we do that is what we are supposed to do if there is one thing that i'm almost sure of in life besides death and taxes is humans are always meant to change we are always meant to evolve whether that be spiritually culturally or individually we constantly change throughout our lives and when we stop changing we're pretty much screwed a big revelation for me was that like if we ever were in a zombie apocalypse we'd all die straight up like nobody wants to band together nobody wants to listen to one another nobody wants to listen to the experts first off we would all just die you'd all have that one idiot in your group that would just get y'all killed so basically just from going on from this year don't jock it off and be like, oh my god, I'm so glad it's over. Because in all honesty, it's kind of not. The problems that we had in this year, we need to resolve in the next coming years. Because if we don't, we're going to continue to repeat the same issues that we had this year. So that kind of sums up, like, a lot of things that people have struggled with individually and also socially. Um... The one biggest thing that I need to change for 2021 is that, like, how I'm easily discouraged. I have wanted to give up every single day, and that has taken its toll. Like, I'm not as hyper as I usually am, because, like, today is just one of those days. Like, I don't know how many times I looked at my YouTube channel, I was just like, I just need to stop. Like, I'm terrible at this, I'm never going to get anywhere, and it's just like, I just need to slow it down. I'm like, I've been doing this for two years, no one's going to, like get anywhere like majorly in two years that's fine that's something that i need to accept and also if i want to get better at something i need to constantly practice it that's the only way that you're going to get better at something with that like discouragement really comes my anxiety which i also need to work on it's just like when i have that moment that thought in my head where it's just like oh my god i'm not good at this i'm terrible at this everyone hates me it's like my anxiety just goes into overdrive. It takes a scene. It's just like, hey, how you doing? I've been waiting for this moment again. And it just takes over. And I have anxiety attacks. I can't eat. I can't sleep. 
and it just literally feels like, you know, this is it. This is what my life is. I'm no one. I have done nothing. I will never do anything. And it just keeps spiraling out of control. If like I need to go on medication for that or if I just need to like work on it personally, but that's that's something that I want to get under control in 2021. So I'm sorry for this very short video. I'm sorry if I didn't go over everything that I needed to. But um, why don't you share with me what your 2020 was like, what you think you personally need to go through in terms of like changing behavior or whatever, and maybe what you kind of saw in this world this year. But I hope you all enjoyed this video and I hope to continue growing and hopefully make a community because I would honestly love to interact with everyone. I would love to have everyone who's watching this video around and I sincerely hope I can do that. Until next time, I hope you all have a great new year and I pray that 2021 is better for all of us. May we grow in peace, prosperity, <laughs> and Hopefully some of us will achieve our dreams. You know what? No, I hope all of us will achieve our dreams. God, it's time for everyone to achieve their dreams. So until next time, stay safe out there and thanks so much for watching. Bye.